You gonna do it? Girl, no. No. <laughs> Sorry. Well, good morning, guys. You may have had a coin in your stash worth thousands of dollars and not even know it. You may remember the 1943 penny that sold for $200,000 last month. Well, Valerie Davis and her mother, Judy, from Richmond and Pearland, saw that story and reached out to me to find out how to get their own coin collection inspected. I took them to the experts at U.S. Coins off the Cape freeway to find out what exactly you should be looking for. General Manager Kenny Duncan Jr. says most importantly, check the dates. Quarters, halves, and dimes pre-1964 are 90% silver. So that's always the first thing to look for, just in pocket change. Um, then you would want to look for very bright, brand new coins. Not polished, but bright and new. A lot of times coins, just because they don't have the right date, they might have the right, um, they might have the right grade as far as being uh, preserved the right way. Okay, so coming up at 6 a.m., Valerie and Judy found a 1943 penny in their inherited collection. So, is it worth thousands as well? We'll walk you through the appraisal process in our next hour.